SZA is back with new music and we couldn't be more excited. She just dropped a new collab with Doja Cat and trust me, ever since her debut album Control made waves in 2017, fans have been counting down the days. To celebrate, let's take it a little further back. Here's a look at SZA's come up. SZA grew up in St. Louis and New Jersey. In high school, she was a gymnast and self-proclaimed science nerd. That passion for science led her to study marine biology in university. At this point, music was not on her radar, and she actually planned on going to grad school and traveling the world as a scientist. But after graduating, she took some time to work and make some money. Now in 2011, while working at Sephora, she started singing in her spare time. Her and some friends in her neighborhood stole beats off the internet and started putting some music together. That same year, her boyfriend brought her to a Kendrick Lamar show, which he was sponsoring with his clothing company. She ended up meeting some of the guys at Top Dog Entertainment. A friend of hers gave some of her songs to the president, who liked what he heard. After releasing her first two EPs, C SZA Run and S, she got signed to Top Dog as the only female on the roster in 2013. Between 2013 and 2015, she released another EP and started exploring songwriting, writing songs for some big names like Beyonce, Nicki Minaj, and Rihanna. Okay, now 2017 was SZA's breakthrough year. She started the year getting her first major label deal with RCA, and by the summer, she dropped her debut album, Control. And it was an insane debut. It came in at number three on the Billboard 200, became certified platinum, and was called the best album of the year by time. 2017 also saw SZA collab with Maroon 5 on the single What Lovers Do, which became her first top 10 as an artist. Her success in 2017 saw her get five Grammy nominations, becoming the most nominated female artist at the 2018 awards. Ever since Control came out, SZA has collabed on singles with a bunch of different artists, including Cardi B, DJ Khaled, Post Malone, Lord, and Justin Timberlake. Plus, she worked with fellow Top Dog entertainer Kendrick Lamar on the single All the Stars for the movie Black Panther, which got her a Golden Globe and Academy Award nomination. And for fans that have been anticipating new music from SZA for the past couple years, they finally got their wish in 2020. Late last year, SZA dropped her two singles, Hit Different and Good Days, the latter of which became her first top 10 single as a solo artist. Both tracks are expected to appear on her highly anticipated sophomore album, which, if it's anything like Control, will be pure fire.